What's happening, y'all? Welcome back to my Vlogmas day number two. My question for today is, what exactly did I start my channel for and what is it that I do? Let's talk about it. Hey y'all, listen, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to my Vlogmas. And I'm glad that you were able to join me for day two. So my question today is why exactly did I start the channel and what is it that I do on a day-to-day -day basis? Well, as far as what I do on a day-to-day -day basis, I guess the first thing that I do is I kind of wake up and I come in and I then I go to maybe my YouTube channel and I start to answer some questions and comments and then I do workshops and yeah, all of that kind of stuff. Yeah, that's that's kind of what I do. How about that? All right. So uh, yeah, that's me in a nutshell. <laughs> How about you? What do you do? So anyway, let me back up for a second. I started my channel probably for the same reasons that a lot of people start a YouTube channel because you're supposed to have one. That's what I was told. That's what I was told. <laughs> anyway, I started my channel and probably like most beginning YouTubers or people that had any sort of video presence, didn't really have a focus, didn't really have a goal, didn't really, wasn't doing a whole lot with it. I was just kind of putting things up from time to time. And that probably was reflected somewhat in, in the way that my business operated as well. There was not like a fine tuned focus. But as I started to focus in on helping people with communication, on helping them with public speaking, on helping them with storytelling, one of the things that I started to notice was that the videos that got the most play on the channel, on my channel, were the ones that were the how-to videos, how to how to do something, how to insert a video on Medium, how to create a landing page, page using Weebly. Those, those are some of the videos. As a matter of fact, I'll post them here so that you can go watch them and get some more views on those videos. All right. <laughs> anyway, I, though, I, as I began to notice that, one of the things that really hit me was that I was not only just helping people with the, the storytelling and the structure piece of things, but the, the technology end of things was something that people were searching for and really interested in as well. So I finally landed at a place where I can say that I help people with the techniques and the technologies of storytelling. And so if you're someone who wants to be able to uh, open up or create a, a better video presence online, but you we need to know what to say, you need to know how to structure it in a way that allows people to listen, that connects with people and how you can, how you can show up in a way that doesn't cause you to ramble. That's one of the things that I help with. And of course I'm, stumbling over my words right now. So that doesn't make me look very professional, does it? Yeah. Anyway. <laughs> All right. So that's, that's in a nutshell, what I do. I work with professionals. I work with business leaders, middle managers, emerging leaders in organizations to do that. And then on the individual side, I work with small business owners, entrepreneurs, and coaches, really helping them to figure out how to structure their messages, how to show up even more confidently so that when people watch their videos, when people watch what they do, what they present, they can show up like a professional. They can show up like an expert. That's what I do in a nutshell. So that's it. That's 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 the big deal. And my vlogmas is pretty short today, but there's no rules. Nobody made up any rules for this thing. So if there's no rules, you can either make up your own or break the ones that are there. Maybe. I don't know. Yeah, we'll see. All right. Anyway, I'll see you tomorrow for the next Vlogmas and I'll subscribe. Subscribe to the channel. Subscribe. That's all I need you to do. Subscribe. See you tomorrow. Peace.